Hello, you guys, and welcome to the very first video of December. We are kicking it off nice and cozy with a cozy decorate with me. You can see I'm cleaning up my kitchen first and foremost. But um, for this year, if you didn't get to catch it, I am doing a classic Hallmark Christmas theme this year. And I'm mostly focusing on my living room, my tree, and my gifts. But I did also add other little touches throughout my apartment too. So I'm just going to show you that in this video. I first started with a simmer pot or a potpourri to set the vibe, set the tone. And oh my god goodness this made my apartment smell so good and just feel so cozy if you've never done a simmer pot i highly recommend trying it especially for the holidays so the one that i did is oranges cinnamon cranberries vanilla extract and cloves i believe you bring it up to a boil and then you bring it down to a simmer and you can let it simmer for like two three hours that's what i did and it just made my apartment smell so cozy. And you can just keep adding water and the aroma just fills your home. And then the only other scent that I had going was my big holiday candle from Target. I'll link the one that I have below. But it was nice to have this touch because it was a touch of pine and muskiness mixed with the sweet aromas from the simmer pot. So I'm first starting with the little touches in my kitchen. I have these mini wreaths. These mini wreaths are from Target. And I just love them. They're flock. They have pine cones. They're just a nice touch to add to the kitchen. And I've never added wreaths to my cabinets. So I thought that would be a nice little different touch this year. I found these mini trees as well. And I put one by my hand soap and my dish soap. I had this one in the bathroom originally. But I decided to put it here just for a little something different. And then I got a mug. This Santa mug is from home goods or tj maxx i believe and so i'm just putting that by my nespresso with another little mini tree to add to my coffee station the hand towels that i'm putting here they're cute they're a little more playful they have the i don't know what it's called like the little red truck with the christmas tree on the back i don't know if there's a specific name for that truck or the little car that's what's on those towels it's very festive and i got these from home goods And you can see I kept it pretty simple in the kitchen with just tiny touches here and there. I don't like a cluttered kitchen, so I wanted to keep this very minimal. Moving on to my living room, I found this huge fluffy perfect garland at home goods i scored on this it was like 34.99 it's long it covers my entire tv stand the one i originally got is similar to this but i felt like it looked a little bit more artificial it just didn't look as realistic as this one does and it wasn't as long and as fluffy the one i originally got is from target and i have that one in my christmas home decor haul if you want to see that but this one to me so much better and the price i think it was cheaper than one garland from target and it was a lot shorter i would have had to get two to get a similar effect to this so definitely a score and i see myself keeping this one for a few years to come so i'm putting this on my tv stand with the decor that i already have sitting there and i just kind of formed it so it would fit perfectly fluffed it a little bit and then i added my little black santa boots that are from target i put these at the end so cute and then for the coffee table i added a gold christmas tree this one i also got from home goods and then i added my big vase and stems the stems are from hobby lobby i want to say i got these last year 
And then the vase is from Crate and Barrel and I got it last year as well. If you watched my home decor haul, you know I was between these stockings and the plaid ones. I feel like majority voted for these and I was on the same page. I ended up keeping these because I feel like I can use them for years to come as well. And then I put my little red houses on here. These light up, but they don't have a timer, so that's kind of inconvenient. But there were five bucks at Target, so you can't beat that. And I just put them there and I feel like it came along really well it looks again simplistic but enough coziness and fullness to make it feel like christmas, christmas for my bathroom very simple as well i put this mat that i got from target right in front of my bathtub so it's nice and cozy when i step out it is pretty fluffy and i love how plush it feels and just the design it's like just you know simple green trees and then these hand towels i found as well at home goods it came in a set of two so i put one right here and then i also put one by the sink so people can dry their hands and then the glitter christmas tree with the burgundy fabric i put it right next to the hand soap just to add a little touch in there as well and in my bathroom i have the same candle that i have in my kitchen just in the single wick version For my bedroom, I love my bedroom, first and foremost. I do wish my bedroom was bigger or I had a smaller bed, but I just love how simplistic my room is, but it just feels very cozy to me. And so I just wanted to add a little touch because I already love how my bedroom feels, but I just, I wanted to have more of that Christmas feel. So I found this pillow at home goods that says Mary. And then I found a plant that has little cranberries in it and it has like the Christmas stems. So I just feel like it's a perfect, perfect touch to my bed and my nightstand. And then on my TV stand, I also decided to add a garland. I had this garland from last year and it does light up. I need to figure out a better way to hide the cables because I can't stick them behind the TV stand because it's heavy. But regardless, I love the way that this turned out. The garland that I put in the living room didn't come with lights, but I did end up buying these battery operated lights from Target and those did the trick. Now for the tree, I will say I want to add a little bit more to the tree, but I don't know if it's just me, but ornaments are sold out everywhere. I'm looking for big brown ornaments because I want to add a little bit more of a size difference and just some brown in there, but I went to the store and no ornaments anywhere. So I don't know if I'm going to be able to add more, but I'm going to show you what I've done so far. And for my tree, I'm just fluffing it. I've had this tree. This is now my third year, I think, with this tree. I love it. However, I will say, and you'll notice this throughout the video, is that the tree tends to pick up, or the lights on the tree, I should say, tend to pick up a little bit more green, like lime green, instead of a warm yellow. And I, that's not my favorite. I wish the lights were a similar tone to the lights that are right above my couch, just like a warm yellow. So I might end up, getting another tree next year we'll see just because i want more of that warmth when it comes to my tree regardless i ended up adding some red ornament you can see the little truck with the little christmas tree on the back too i added some of those those are from hobby lobby i added some scented pine cones as well some cranberry picks from target also and yeah a mix of just red and gold ornaments throughout i think the brown ones will really make it pop like a bronzy brown so i'm gonna keep my eye out for some of those if you guys know where i can get some online like asap let me know because i want to make my tree a lot fuller and i just want to add a little bit more
And the faux leather poof. I added that right next to the couch, between the couch and the tree. And I got these new pillow covers that match perfectly with the poof. You can kind of see them in the background right there. They have like a leather, faux leather stripe on them. And then I've already wrapped a few gifts. So I added those under there just to add the final touch to it. I think for me, my decor really comes together once all of the gifts are wrapped because it just gives it a different wow factor. So I'll make sure to keep you guys updated on my Instagram stories. And I'm sure you guys will see it in vlogs too, how it turns out. It's coming along. I found these cute name tags at Hobby Lobby that go perfectly with my theme. Here's how everything looks in the daylight when the lights are off and it's just the natural lighting. I think it came out really good, cute, simple, cozy, but still more of those classic Hallmark Christmas colors. Thank you guys so much for tuning in to my cozy decorate with me i will link everything that i can find down below in the description box of course i'm excited to push out some holiday content for you guys this year i love you guys and i'll see you all in my next video